Welcome back to the Blissful Badger. This is the Badger Blog, Episode 2. So it's been another week, and I had another game. Played 1900 points, Blood Angels vs. Tyranids. My Blood Angels won my first game of 9th edition ever. It was top of turn 3. It was about to be my turn. I was already up 34 to 10, and we called the game. I'd say that definitely mostly has to do with the Assault Doctrine about to start, for those that know 40k. Um, that and Sticky Objectives, which definitely helped with my forward assault against his big monsters. It was pretty cool. I'm thrilled that I had an actual win, and it looks for... Uh, yeah, I can speak. Woo! Um, I look forward to the next game, and seeing how the Blood Angels army finally uh, rolls out, and how much better I can get with that unit. I, I wasn't really thrilled with the Death Company Intercessors. I have a unit of five, and I think I would rather have more Assault Intercessors. There's so many more benefits to the Blood Angels army with them. So I might see about getting another five, ten of those to swap out elites for more troops. I'm already running, in the 2000 point list, I'm already running 30 Assault Intercessors and 20 tactical marines, so there's not very much room left for actually increasing the troop cho choices, but that might be a possibility. So as far as hobbying goes, outside of the game, I had a build and prime fest. So I primed up the models that I had built last week that I hadn't gotten to actually prime. And I look forward to painting them at some point. But the weather is kind of iffy at the moment, so it was more important to get them primed than painted. I can paint while it's cold and wet and all of that other stuff, but priming requires a nice day with a decent temperature and no rain, and I still don't have my uh, <laughs> my airbrush station set up, so I can't airbrush prime yet. Uh, something to look forward to in the future. Um, but I have two units of obliterators, a unit of Deathwing Knights, and two uh, Adeptus Mechanicus models that I'm planning to use as Castellan robots. So, I just decided to model as as I wanted so that they could look cool. I really like the double saw blades on this guy, and I look forward to painting them up. At the moment, those are the only Admech models that I have built or, and or primed. So I have a little ways to go before I get to them. I think I want to have a unit of the Vanguard built up and test paint on those before I do the robots. But I may do the robots first. I haven't really decided. Um, I didn't make any jewelry and I didn't go on any hikes this week. Again, it was very rainy out, and most days weren't too cold, but it was, you know, when it's rainy, it's kind of not as enjoyable to go, you know, hiking. I do enjoy the summer rains and hiking, but when it gets cold, it's not as much fun. Um, I didn't actually finish painting any models this week. Um... I did start working on some shipping containers, 
I'll show those in next week's video because I'll finish them by then. Um, when they're just pieces on a pizza box after painting some, it doesn't really look as good. So, if for some reason you want to see those, you know, mid-working mid process, then let me know. Um, I plan on painting up a few more models over the next week, and hopefully getting another game in. Let's see if the Blood Angels can win another game. Raise my win rate to 50%. That would be really nice. Um, I'm planning a few more videos in the coming weeks. Not just the hobby vlogs. Um, I hope that they come out well. And I'm interested to seeing which ones you prefer and which ones you don't. So definitely leave some comments, let me know what you want to see and what, you know, and I'll see if I want to, uh, yeah, see if I want to follow those along. Um, can't guarantee that I'll do everything that you ask, but, you know, might be interesting. Um, But until next week, uh, I hope you find your bit of bliss.